just explain to me the difference between CME and SIBO for this purpose. Uh, which is more advantageous to somebody trading in futures? Well, thank you for having me. It's a pleasure to be here on a Monday morning after a late Sunday evening. <laughs> so the differences between the exchanges are really the CBO and the, the CFE is geared more towards a, a retail offering, right? It's one Bitcoin per contract, where the CME is at five times that, five Bitcoins per contract. But I think Camilla touched upon a number of important points. Um, but the overarching theme I'd like to point out is the volumes that we're seeing this morning don't necessarily reflect the, the level of interest that we're seeing. So I think we've been conditioned over the years to, to look at these launches as being sort of the kickoff of the starting gun of a race. And, and that's not the case here. This has been a highly unusual launch for the, both of these products. And uh, I, I think that they, they have a lot of room to grow and there's a, a enormous interest on the, on the client side and on the trading side. Lisa touched upon earlier, you know, the VIX touching lows. When you look at Bloomberg and you, you, you look at the equivalent of the Bitcoin, the volatility is somewhere around a 90 where the, uh, uh, Lisa just touched upon that the, the VIX is at all-time lows or three-year lows. So you can see why there's such enormous interest uh, in, in these products. Bob, uh, from your perspective as a trader of uh, Bitcoin futures, is it particularly lucrative because of larger bid-ask spreads? Is this a, a sort of profitable trade to uh, be involved in? Well, you, you, you hit it right on the head. So the Chicago community is a trading community. Uh, the fact that there's a larger bid-ask spread, the fact, the fact that it's so volatile, uh, makes it very interesting to the Chicago community. I, I, our office is in the Board of Trade. It's a beautiful Art Deco building, uh, majestic building at the end of La Salle Street. It's filled with traders, right? You can feel this building coming back to life, sort of like night at the museum as they're waiting for this product to come on. But I, to go back to the, to the volumes, um, we, we, there's a lot of work that needs to be done